Feature Friday. The freshest. Bitch. It's a way nicer experience. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm being an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm you got saying. it. Uh, okay. I want one of those donuts. It's, it's very childish though, I like it. Oh, Jay Park. Jay Park! He's back! This is the year he came back! Really? Yes! After his uh, sort of escape from them. Yeah. Oh, he has. What do he you call those? Back. What do you call those? Dreads? Uh, I think so. Keon Park. 52 million views. See, he's the first one to portray lifestyle like that. Yeah. But we know he's not a normal. CL. She's back. Ooh, damn. Eh. Wow. Becky on. Beautiful. Yeah. That looks like. Nice. Nice. Beautiful, beautiful boy. This was such a song. Hey, check that booty, that booty, booty. 64 million views, but yeah, it was so freaking cool. <laughs> the Paul Baji. Baji. Napal, napal, napal. I freaking love him. Are you excited? I do. She's made. She's made hits. Oh, I just love her. She's got such beautiful vocals. She just kills it this. every single year. Yeah, we've seen this. Ah, oh, she's so hot. Oh, damn. Damn, girl. She's just so cool. Tay Young. Young. One of my favorite vocalists. Yeah, this song was so good. Yeah, we heard the song again from my daddy. I got it from my daddy. daddy. Hey. <laughs> I'm telling you, any year he decides to release, you're just effed. I'm just gonna say this: up to 2016, Huna and Sai were just kicking butts. Huna, Sai, and G Dragon. He wasn't in this. He one. was. Oh yeah, true. Yeah. He, he was. was. He's been. He's been consistent for three whole, years. Yeah, true. Yeah. And if not him, like Big Bang, basically, well, T.O.P. was also in there, so... From 2012 to 2016, yeah, they were literally freaking kicking butts. Now, he had... Oh, obviously, because he went to, uh, uh, to the army. That, that's why he hasn't been that active yeah. lately in the last two years. Crazy! Cool. Huna really, like, really kicks butts. Yeah. She's really freaking cool. Tae hey, Young. Hey, young. Yeah. Reminds me a bit of Harry Styles, that video. A little bit, yeah. Oh, it's glittery water as well. Okay, hope. Hey, hope. Boy meets evil. Oh, that looks cool. I'm down to watch that. Tell you on again. Young again. That was her year. She changed hairs. No, she just got extensions. No, she went black. Uh. Oh, the sentence of the sun. What? Another drama that I <laughs> cried with. <laughs> so what are you talking about? I literally... Ezra, Kay Kay Will. Will. Also very consistent. From the same drama. I cried with a freaking drama. But look at them. So he on again. Hit after hit, dog. She was killing it. Nice. Lee 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 Bree. Bree. That was made me cry. Lee Hai. Lee Hai. Lee Hai. Yeah. Sure. I think. I think so. Crush. Hey. And this is from Goblin. Of course. We watched this, remember? Yeah. So. Beautiful love. So. <laughs> could, Beautiful day. Could press pause. So it seems now, this is also a recurring theme I'm noticing. That a good promotional move is to put songs, your song, in a in a drama in a show. Very popular. That drama. doesn't do that well here. No, in a, in the actually, world. it doesn't. If but you put a song in a series, it kills it. Yes, it like makes it. 
Back home, that was the thing though, in las novelas. If you wanted a singer to blow, you would put their song as the theme song of the novela that was popping. And then that the song will... And yeah, it would make the, the, the artist blow. Like, well. look at, for example, some of the most popular, some of the most popular songs, like uh, some of the most popular series last year. Like, what, what was popping? Game of Thrones, Lucifer. Uh, uh, um, Riverdale. Riverdale. Uh... Or, or, you know, look even a little further back. Vampire Diaries, the originals, you know, all those... Teen Wolf, team... stuff like that. Name me a song that you would actually remember that went number one because of the series. Mm, or what song went number one because of the series? I don't know. None. I don't None. So. I don't actually think there's one. But they do put new artists in, into the, the, the shows, but now, they don't really... I think now it's become more of a mafia. So now it's become more, hey, do you want to promote your song? Or, hey, let's get the rights to this song to put it here because it's cheaper to get these bands that are upcoming rather than getting, I don't know, Drake. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, So sure. it, I, I think it's become more like that. It, more about, you know, Monopoly rather than, than actually a song and then you promote only that song as the intro song, you know, and then boom. Because, uh, like, one of my favorite series, Lucifer, I don't even know what the intro song is. Who sings it? Bow! <laughs> 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 That's the only thing I remember from the intro. Wow! Oh, the end. <laughs> what about what about Vampire Diaries? I don't think they have an intro song. They have like an instrumental thingy. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm completely wrong. I don't know. Let us know. Oh. Wow! Beautiful day. Great video. Oh, this day. To the to the to the STD. One of my favorite rap EPs ever. Whoa! Ninety-five million. Ten. Ah, oh, he did from Descendants of the Sun too. I used to sing the song without knowing. Wow. She she saw she saw how the main character, the main male lead, kissed someone else. No. Slept some, with his no, best friend. No. Ah, uh, definitely not my type of series then. <laughs> <laughs> Kicked some butts to some hooligans in the street. But in the she was in a hospital. Yeah, but she he brought them in because they were injured, but he caused the injuries. Also, she saw the injuries he, he caused. <laughs> in the CCTV, yeah. Typical. <laughs> Typical. Uh, yeah, I'm a badass. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He actually, he's he is literally the 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 description of a badass, like. <laughs> so over this but he's becoming softer and softer no 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 but she never ate it and that's the whole interaction she was like oh come on get over yourself the whole time and then did they get, did they get together yeah they did spoiler alert man <laughs> <laughs> ah but if you haven't seen that you haven't oh is it not new no not that i'm meant to know if it's not new it was like from 2016 i think all oh, right fair enough yeah that's like spoiling infinity War. oh damn it, damn it. Oh! oh that's hot Look how little he's doing. He looks so different. <laughs> I want to watch that music video. I think a lot of people would like you to watch that video. Yes, I I would love to watch the music video. I'm, re like, I'm really like astonished how, how many um like comments about uh tem like you know when we watch Temin or when we watch dance or like dancing videos. And then people are like, oh my gosh, you should definitely go and, and watch Temin and stuff. And I don't know why we haven't. Yeah, well, why haven't we? That yeah. was beautiful. So again, another song from Goblin. Ailey. This is from Goblin. Really? Another, like, the word alien Crush. Guy. No, the, from Crush. Beautiful life. Yeah, this is the alien guy. Yeah. No. Oh, right. The Goblin guy. I thought I've never watched Goblin. Freaking hell, that's the one I watch every every Christmas. Christmas. Yes, And I yes. cry. You do, you do. Every yeah. Christmas. She genuinely does. <laughs> every single time. <laughs> How could you not cry with that playing in the background? You're like... <laughs> Say young again, consistent, dude. She's such a vibe. Are you? Consistent as well. No, well, since last, since 2016, she's gonna go. Oh, she's so good. 
And there you go. Love it. I love it. I've never heard this one. Me neither. I love it. Same as the Napao Banji, whatever it is. One of my favorite videos we watched. So little with and so much. It was so beautiful. Everything about this was so well done. Sunmi. Sunmi. Yashina. Oh yeah, I've, I've seen this. Yashina. Monica showed me this when this came out. I was like, oh wow. Serendipity. We gotta watch that, dude. Yeah. What happened we? I don't know. I think for the, our podcast, BTS Part 2. I you. For BTS Part 2 podcast, special podcast, what we're gonna do, I think, let us know if you like this. Solo work. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just that, 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 that. That should be, you know, like seven good songs. And then, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe like an this interview. This is literally my favorite IU song ever. Featuring G, G Dragon. G Dragon. Yeah. I'm doing fine. Oh, is this where they're like on a, on, a, on a like a computer? Yeah, it's just like inside of the computer. This is literally my favorite song she's ever made. Yeah, yeah. So good. I've never seen this either. Oh yeah, I know this one. New face. <laughs> New face. <laughs> Ooh. Go Dean, my boy. Dude. Okay, the more I listen to Dean, the, the better he gets. The more you fall in the, love the with more, him. The more I realize how much of an absolute bloody genius that guy is. He is a musical genius. Oh, I got shivers. Because he's so good, he's that good. Or it's just cold here. Sure. Just give him the vibe, dude. <laughs> give him the vibe. What I was saying is that I just, when you listen to Dean, like, I just I just get this super broody, super like, I'm so into myself. Like, uh, I understand my world in yeah. a very different way. I'm so artistic. <laughs> but, and I don't actually know what he's like. I, I have not, not seen anything. He did a podcast with uh, Eric Nam, didn't he? Was it Eric Nam? Yeah, I think I wa I don't know. I don't know if it was Eric Nam, but I watched he's something podcast, where he was yeah. talking about how he sees the industry and like why he's he's done what he's done with his career, you know, and how how he feels about everything else. It is kind of yeah. chilly in here. Yeah, and I do it's think bloody sixth of July and we're freezing. Yeah, I think uh, he would also. Uh, I think he has like he's collaborated with you know Anderson Pack. He's collaborated with some of the artists. so hot. Yeah, so I, I think he really has great potential. And I think he speaks English as well, so... A little bit, I think so, yeah. He, mate. He was here in London not long ago and... Sky's the limit uh, for him, I think. Yeah, he's he's awesome. I, I really am really down for his stuff. Sup, people, if you're a dancer... <laughs> Sup, people, if you're watching this and you're a rapper or a beat producer... A singer, a ghostwriter, or even just somebody who likes new music. And this is for you. Feature Friday is the show where we make new music every week featuring your tracks, your raps, your lyrics, or yourself as an artist. There's no catch. This isn't one of those weird posts where you click on the website and you're trying to order airports and they say it's free and then you have to pay like a hundred thousand million dollars for uh, shipping. Uh, this is completely free. We understand how difficult it is in the music industry to get seen and there's so many amazing rappers and singers and beat producers out there. So this is just a place to showcase your skills. We showcase our skills. We make music every week, which we love doing anyways. We get to show new artists to new people and new people to the new artists. So if you'd like to get featured next, message me here on Instagram or email me and we will get in touch pretty soon. Please do it fast because uh, a waiting list is forming and we don't want anyone waiting around. Keep scrolling by. See you Friday. Peace. Bye-bye.